Hi, and thanks for watching. This video shows how to set up multiple locations for inventory and how to use transfer orders to move items between the locations. We can use locations to manage the inventory we keep in multiple storage facilities or just to keep track of where we keep things in your shop. For example, if we store items at the front and back. In the Business Manager Role Center, the location setup is under Setup and Extensions, Manual Setup, and Locations. A few locations are already set up. We can set up as many locations as we need and enter information about them on the location card. If we use In Transit locations, we can specify that on the location card. Most businesses set up a few of these. We'll need to set up an inventory posting group for each location. These control the GL transactions during a transfer. It's a good idea to review existing inventory posting group setup. Now we can start purchasing items for a location by entering the location code in the purchase document. It's that simple. If we want to see where items are, the item card shows availability in each location. When we sell items, we can choose the location where we ship the items from. To help us provide quality service to our customers, on the customer card, we can specify a default location to ship from for each customer. For example, a location that ensures speedy delivery because it's close to the customer. When we need to move items from one location to another, we use transfer orders to document where the items went. Depending on our needs, we can ship and receive the items in one go, line by line and even partially. If we move the items all at once, we can just choose the direct transfer checkbox on the transfer order. Otherwise, we'll use the in-transit code to select an in-transit location to track items during the transfer. Typically, we'll use the same in-transit location for transfers. To avoid selecting the in-transit code every time, we can set up transfer routes where the location is already chosen. We can also specify a specific shipping agent for a transfer route. Business Central can let us know when we're selling an item that's out of stock at a specific location. When that happens, we can check availability in other locations. And if it is, we can either specify that location on the sales document or create a transfer order to move items to the original location. We can also use various reports to check item availability at specific locations. We just need to choose one. That's it! Thanks for watching this video about how to use multiple locations and transfer orders in Business Central.